What is up everybody, AJ here back with another video. So I'll be checking out the third trailer for Fate Samurai Remnant which will be released in 3 weeks time. Now I have not um, pre-purchased the game yet because I'm, to this day I'm still not really convinced on whether I should really get my hands on the game or not. Although I will say that um, Musashi's um, <coughs> uh, alternate outfit looks really good but part of me still like I uh, should I really get this game on day one or not I'm not really sure and not to mention I'm not really sure whether uh, my current PC is able to run uh, this game or not and so, but still regardless right um, I will be checking this, this trailer out and hopefully um, this trailer can convince me to get my hands on this game on day one and so, um, without further ado, let's check out the tra trailer for Fate Samurai Remnant. Ixo. Okay. Edo 1651. Oh! Okay, nice. Yep, it's Gilgamesh in the flesh. Why? Because I'm game with this. Uh, was that a mini game? Okay. I forgot his name though. Another servant that is not from the Edo area era. Once again, I forgot the name though, but I'm sure I, I, I saw her, her in the Big Grand Order. Huh? Alright, because of the, the, the servant effect where she can turn um, enemies into animals. But I forgot the name though because it's been quite some time since, <laughs> since the last time I played Fragrant Order. Oh, Ooh, I don't know how to get out of here. I don't know how to get out of here. I don't know how to get out of here. Whoa, what the hell? Snakes? Ogres? Okay. I was afraid he was about to scream Excalibur, but never mind. So yeah, available on September 29. Yeah, I was yeah as I was saying that dress really looks good on Musashi. I will say that. Okay, if you don't mind, right? Let let's um have a thorough look of the the trailer if you guys don't mind. So okay, um we'll be roaming the entire area. There's Gilgamesh, and what what is this though? I have no idea what is this is. Is this an item or some sort? Looks like then uh, looks like items. Oh, okay. Ne never mind. Moving on. If only it's in English, though. If only it's in English. And then there's the um. Uh, yeah, there's the crafting mini game where yeah, this is the this is like this is a crafting mini game where you just um. You just mash the the button in in sequence before the time runs out. But what is the purpose though? I'm just I'm genuinely curious. Fortify the workshop. And okay, you can customize the um, I believe you can customize weapons. Yeah, and there's um you can add you can increase the effect, you can increase the effect. But I'm just I'm what I'm curious is um the weapon custom customization is only available for um, Miyato, Miyamoto Yuri or it will be available for other characters. I'm not so sure. And it looks like yeah, we get to select um different um characters. Cool. 
I'm definitely if if I were to play this right, I would definitely bring in bring in Musashi if if given the opportunity without a shadow of doubt. I would bring her bring her in all the way, and then of course um you le- you have to level up the skill. This is like somewhat similar as how the uh kind of reminds me of how um, Honkai Star Rail's um the the skill system works, but it should be different somewhere where okay. You unlock one skill and then you are you unlock one skill and then you unlock the ne- the next uh, the next one and whatnot yada yada yada. I think it should be that way. I might be wrong. And yes, yeah, I I see. Yeah, I see. Oh, hold on a sec. Hold on. Yeah, I I I remember see. I forgot once again. I forgot the name of the of this server though, but I'm pretty sure I. She appeared in the uh, the mobile game Freaking Order as well. I remember where her noble phantasm, or uh, or should I say, her ultimate is basically um, she turns enemies into animals, which is shown yeah right over here. And then yeah, there's a lot of roaming, and it looks like you get to travel uh, on on water as well. So hold on, there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, seven. Um, of course, um, Holy Great Wars. Um, seven master, seven servants. The usual. But what I really wish is that I hope all of the um, the servants are playable, just like John uh, John Dia over here. And then there's the um, this is the the the, the giant Oni Oni that I. I know we. I'm pretty sure I'm, I've seen this kind of only in a uh, fate order game as well. I forgot what's the official name, so sorry. But yeah, I've seen this kind of only when I've in uh, frequent order before. When we during the um, Shimosa was it the the epic of Remnant 1.5 Chapter 3 where um, we exploring where we're clearing the the quest with the uh, Musashi. Yeah, and I will say this. Musashi looks so goddamn fine in that Fantas Fantasmal dress. Wah, chef's kiss. And that's pretty much my reaction to the third trailer of Fate Samurai Remnant. Um, to be very honest, right, even though I have watched this trailer, I'm still not really convinced whether I should um, get my hands on this um, game on day one or not. But I will def um, I will definitely um, try out this game for sure. Uh, we'll, we'll see how it goes, and hopefully. Once again, as I mentioned earlier, hopefully um, my PC is able to run this game as um, smoothly as possible. We'll, we'll, we'll see how things goes first. Hope I'm. There might be a, a, a launch trailer sometime later in the future, just like how other games uh, how other games does. But right before the launch of the game, where they will launch a, a have a launch trailer, so that um, pe- to attract people to. Con- to convince people to buy the game, we'll see um, how things goes. And so, thank you guys for watching. Um, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, I do appreciate a thumbs up on this video. And feel free to comment down on below as well regarding um, this the uh, Fate Samurai and then and what are <coughs> and what are your thoughts on this game? Anyway, uh, my name is AJ, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.